In this video, I'm going to show you how you can farm some of the airdrops daily on ZK Sync and also certain tasks that you can complete daily. Now, the first on the list is uh, Velocore. Now, Velocore is there on Linea as well as ZK Sync. Now, all you have to do is you will need to go to a ZK Sync version of Velocore and click on loot box over here and simply click on get free daily loot box. Now, you can go ahead and uh, claim this free daily loot box over here. And there are different tiers of uh, rewards. As you can see, there is bronze, silver, gold and platinum. And also they have this uh, weekly bonus quest where you have to go ahead and finish certain tasks in order to get this platinum chest over here. Now this will hold the highest value as it's uh, it has the highest tier. Now once you have this, all you can do is basically you can go ahead and open all of this chest over here. Now if we go ahead and vote, you can basically go ahead and vote also and then you can basically go ahead and bribe in order to get some additional voting rewards now if we talk about the rewards over here you would be able to see all your rewards over here now with regards to the loot boxes let me go ahead and open few of this so i will go in my collection over here and i will go ahead and open this one now we'll wait for the transaction to finish and I will simply go ahead and sign it on my MetaMask wallet. So it's taking a bit of time over here, but uh, it will open all of this. And I think I will be getting all of all of the NFTs uh, once I open uh, this loot boxes. So we'll come back to this. Uh, I don't know when it will be finished. OK, so it's finished now. So as you can see, you are getting this uh, module NFT over here multiple module NFT as you can see. So I have now received one of this. Now this NFTs will help you secure some future airdrops if any on ZK Sync. So as you can see future tokens from ZK Sync will be airdropped to NFT holders across four tiers. So you can go ahead and collect all of this uh, daily. Now the next thing uh, that you can do is basically you can connect your wallet over here on robots farm. Now uh, links in the description if you want to go ahead and join my guild. Also, I will leave the link in the description for Velocore and rest of the th things uh, that I'm going to show you in this video. So all you have to do is once you are here on quest, uh, you can uh, play this for free daily. And once you click on this, you get certain items over here. So if we talk about the items, there are a lot of items that you can go ahead and collect on robots farm. And then there are crates uh, that you can go ahead and open. So I will go ahead and open one of this crate over here, for example. And let's see if I get a token airdrop. Okay, so I got this 0.1 token airdrop. That was fast. Let me try to open this again, maybe. Okay, so I don't have enough items to open the level 3 one. But uh, once I have it, I will go ahead and open it. So as you can see, I received some Robert's Farm as uh, tokens as airdropped over here and some gold over here, which I can use it. Now the next thing that you want to do is uh, you have to go to Ruby score over here and you can go ahead and vote for uh, ZK Sync daily and some other uh, L2s are also there like base there is Zora there is uh, scroll linear blast now what this will do is basically it will help you get some uh, transaction volume on different L2s over here now please uh, don't spam it like uh, 100 times a day do it only once a day. Uh, in order to avoid uh, getting your wallet flagged as Sybil. So I've already done for the day, but you can go ahead and vote for each one of them daily. And then basically you can go ahead and claim this if you want to go ahead and claim this. Now, as you can see, you can also track your uh, rank uh, on different L2s with regards to the airdrop farming or the activity. So my wallet on ZK Sync is like in top 1% over here, which you can go ahead and check it later. Now you can also do the similar thing on all two. The first thing that you can do is you can go to daily check in over here and uh, complete this on the ZK Sync era network. And also you can go ahead and deploy some contracts on different L2s over here. So there is ZK Sync scroll mode, linear, then there is chroma, base, blast, Zora. So you can simply go ahead and deploy this over here. Now you would be also able to track your ranking across different uh, L2s potentially for airdrop over here you simply have to go ahead and copy and paste your address over here and then 
you would be able to find your rank now the next thing that you might want to do is uh, you have to go to trala.me over here and basically for this you will need to have a invite code now join their discord and participate in some events and try to get the invite code and once you have the invite code basically you can go ahead and get some gacha tickets through different event and try to open the gacha tickets in order to have a 2% chance of getting the trala og nft now this is basically a game five platform on the zk sync and you might want to keep an eye on it now the next thing that you can do is uh, you can go to sync swap over here and maybe if you want to go ahead and do some some swaps over here you can go ahead and do this now for some reason the loyalty program is paused and for some reason uh, we are not able to get the points over here but still we are expecting a sync swap airdrop in the future so you can go ahead and finish this one and basically you can use the pay masters features over here instead of ETH you can pay with some other coins and tokens that will help you get some transactions on ZK sync using pay masters and similarly you can do the similar thing with uh, velocore also so in order to claim the loot box you simply have to click any other coin or token apart from ethereum in order to activate the pay masters transaction now i personally feel that more the pay master transaction more would be better for your wallet because i think zk sync might focus on uh, this one pay master feature although none of this is the financial advice do your own research now the next thing that you might want to do is you might want to go to app.layer.3xyz and uh, you have to simply go down over here and search for zk sync quest and try to finish all of this quest so there are multiple quest over here as of now as you can see i have completed around 52 quest on the zk sync era network and also if we go down over here uh, in the streaks uh, you can check the one uh, with uh, zk sync so as you can see they have this feature over here swap on zk sync so i will simply go ahead and swap this and it's completed similarly you can do the similar thing with base now i'm not sure whether it will check my base transaction for the day or not if not then i would be able to go ahead and mint the cube okay so if i continue i would be able to go ahead and mint this cube over here so let me switch to base over here and i will go ahead and mint this cube <coughs> so for now i will cancel this because uh, I'm on ZK Sync era network right now on my MetaMask wallet and uh, later on I will switch it to base and then go ahead and claim this one. Now if you are into NFTs, uh, you might want to actually go ahead and uh, buy certain NFTs over here. Now Element uh, would be also coming up with uh, their airdrop and uh, links in the description for sign up on Element where you will be getting 20 LE rewards if you do an active transaction on the Ethereum mainnet. But uh, here you can go ahead and basically purchase your NFTs if you want on the ZK Sync era network. Now the next one that you might want to focus is uh, the multi-chain DEX on uh, ZK Sync which is GRVT. Now once again you will need to have an invite code for GRVT. For this week my quota is full but uh, as soon as I get it after 4 days I will be sharing my invite link with you guys. So you can go ahead and sign up. Now the next thing that you can do is once again this is the NFT platform over here I will switch to I will go ahead and cancel basically you can buy uh, some NFTs on ZK Sync or on ZK Markets now you can do this only if you are into NFTs now to be honest the NFTs on ZK Sync are doing pretty good these days and hopefully if the ZK Sync uh, token drops soon then uh, we can see all the flow price of all these NFTs shoot up drastically now if you purchase uh, some items on uh, zk markets basically uh, they have a current campaign which is going on with whole station where you would be able to mint a free nft so you can go ahead and check that on galaxy uh, links in the description now the next thing that you might want to do is uh, you might want to have a whole station wallet again uh, you can sign up uh, links in the description <coughs> And basically what you can do is you can go and hold some hold station tokens in that wallet so i will show you the price of hold station so as you can see it's around five dollars now in order to 
get this daily chest on uh, whole station you have to like hold a minimum of like uh, 25 whole station tokens and you have the chance of getting eth or maybe bitcoin or gold or some there are a lot of things uh, that you can get to this treasure chest over here and also you can go ahead and basically uh, stake your whole station tokens now i think the minimum amount of stake is like 100 whole station tokens in order to receive some treasure chest daily and also you can do some uh, transactions on whole station like uh, you can deal in futures now please be careful while dealing in futures as you might end up taking high leverage and get your position liquidated so you have to be very careful so these are some of the things that you can do on zk sinkara daily in order to build up some volume transaction and as well as uh, get some other airdrops apart from zk sync and this is all for this video and in case if you have any doubts and questions please feel free to leave a comment i would be more than happy to help you hope you like my video thank you for watching